This month's TV 47 Star Student of the Month from Fayetteville School is brought to you by State Representative Ron Johnson and Curtis and Son Funeral Home. Hey, we welcome Kenny York. Uh, Kenny is a student at Fayetteville School. And Kenny, good morning. Good morning. Thank you for being with us this morning. Tell us all about yourself, Kenny. Um, I'm Kenny York. I am 12 years old. I'm in seventh grade at Fayetteville High School school and I live with my aunt and uncle. Uh, talk about being a seventh grader at Fayetteville School. A lot of uh, our viewing audience, uh, a lot of kids go to Fayetteville School even from the Sylacauga area and you actually got your start here in Sylacauga City Schools as well. Mm -hmm. Yes sir. Uh, my When you uh, began at Fayetteville, what, what grade did you start there? Second grade. Okay. And uh, being in the seventh grade now, what's that like this year? Uh, it's a little more tough. And it, I'm in an eight, not, not AP, but pre-AP. It, like, it's like more rigorous, mm -hmm. like hard. And there's like more homework and more studying for tests to prepare us for high school. Who's your family? Uh, my mom and dad are Keith York and Dina York. Uh, but I live with my aunt. Uh, Tracy Frost and my uncle Rick Frost. Okay, and uh, you want to be, be a meteorologist when you grow up, right? Yes, sir. How did you get started in, in the thought process of that? Well, in 2011 we had that major storm come through and James Spann and J.P. G, J. P. Dice gave, got us through, so they're my inspiration. Was that the tornadoes or what, which one was, what storm system was that? Basically the tornadoes. Yeah. Yeah, well, we got cold weather coming up this week. Are you gonna be on top of that? We, we need we need a, a, a junior meteorologist here. You can shoot us a weather forecast, okay? We'll okay. give you credits for it. Uh, you want to go? Where would you go to college to be a meteorologist? Any idea? Uh, it's in between Auburn and Alabama. Okay. And uh, what about being in the Fayetteville area? I hear a lot of. Uh, good reports about uh, how friendly the Fayetteville community is. What do you think about that? It's a good school. Everybody's so friendly. The teachers are very helpful. They help you through when you get tough times, like when you're doing work and mm -hmm. like to talk to. Now, uh, what do you like to do outside of school? What kind of hobbies you got? I really don't have a hobby. I just like to help my aunt and uncle take care of my sister. Okay. Yeah, well, hey, how old's your sister? One. All right. That's a busy time right there, isn't it? Very busy. But that's a great time, too. Uh, you have a favorite teacher there at the school? Uh, I know it's kind of putting you on the spot, but... Uh, probably... I like all my teachers, but if I had to choose one, I would choose Miss Whitehead. All right. Now, who is she? She is my reading teacher. Um, she, she is very fun to... She's a good teacher to teach. Do you and like she... to read? I'm not big of a fan of reading, yeah. but she kind of helps me, helps mm -hmm. me and my other cl classmates yeah. get through, mm -hmm. like, like when we're reading a book, she helps us, like, comprehend mm -hmm. stuff. Um, uh, what's your favorite subject at Fayetteville? Uh, math. Okay. And, uh, being a, wanting to be a meteorologist, you need those math skills for sure. Um, uh, who in your life, uh, Kenny, who... Who has inspired you and reminds you that, hey, you can do this, you can be a success? Who would that be? That would be my grandfather because he always volunteers to do stuff, even though he has some disabilities, mm -hmm. like like cut grass, but my, un my uncle does it. So he just encourages me to go on with my life. You get to spend a lot of time with your grandfather? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, we're talking with Kenny York, who is a seventh grader, 12 years old, at Fayetteville School. And uh, the school staff and teachers are always encouraging, I'm sure. And how does it, uh, you know, you talk about the community of Fayetteville, how closely knit it is together and how everybody helps one another. Is, is that something that you want to grow from and, and do that in your years as well? Yes, sir. Okay. Okay. Uh, we're talking with uh, Kenny York, who's a seventh grader at Fayetteville School. You're getting ready for uh, Christmas and all that kind of stuff. You uh, are part of a church there in Fayetteville. What about your church? 
I go to Cornerstone Church of Christ. Mm -hmm. It's a good church. It's right. It's on the Beville Highway. It's like in the open field. I know who your preacher is too. You do? No, I do. He's a good guy, and I've known him a long time. Uh, you like to ride golf carts and play video games. What kind of video games do you like to play? I like to play Minecraft and uh, Call of Duty. When you play video games, do you think that helps you in your mind with your schoolwork and stuff? As far as energizing you and stuff like that? Well, not not Call of Duty, but mm -hmm. Minecraft, because mm -hmm. it could like help you learn like geometry and yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. Helps you learn like how to like engineer and build stuff. You got one of those laptops too iPad? It Chromebooks? Yeah. yeah. Yes, sir, I do. Do all the students have those? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, I hope you uh, are continued uh, successful. And uh, seventh grader Kenny York uh, from Fayetteville School. And uh, throughout this year, I mean, you got a couple of years before you get into high school uh, as far as uh, your so uh, freshman year in the high school. But at Fayetteville in your seventh grade year, what has been good for you so far this year? Um, well, I've been getting good grades and my ACT scores are getting higher mm -hmm. every time I take it. So it's so that way I can like get into a good college and I go through my life. Have you have you thought about being in the seventh grade? Have you thought about the importance of hey, I got to get this now in my high school career and and uh, uh, seventh and eighth grade years because I'm going to grow up. And and I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna be successful in life too. I never thought of that like the first couple of days of school, but now that I have so much responsibility in my hands, it it like it it came to me that I need to be responsible, and it'll help me get through my last years of middle school. Well, I got a feeling you'll do very well, Kenny. Thank you for coming this morning. Thank you, Kenny York, who's the seventh grader down at Fettwell School. He's twelve years old. And uh, favorite teacher, Miss Whitehead. And he's a member, uh, he goes to a church at the Cornerstone Church of Christ on the Fettel Highway. And the inspirational person, I like that, being a granddad, uh, Jesse Pugh uh, is an inspirational person in Kenny's life. Kenny, thanks for being with us and uh, congratulations. We got more Daybreak coming up right after this timeout. This Star Student of the Month has been brought to you by State Representative Ron Johnson and Curtis and Son Funeral Home. Tune in to Daybreak for your Star Student of the Month.